Hello, this is Nate. This better be important. I'm gonna be trying out some new Era RF1 trucks. Have you heard about those? They're gold. They're really fast. I'm super excited. You should check out the review. I've definitely put on a little bit of weight since the last time I filmed a review, so I'm pretty excited about that. <laughs> Hello, everybody. I'm Nate Blackburn. I'm Parker Schmidt. Parker, look at me. You're gorgeous. You're beautiful. I believe in you. And today we're here to give you a review of the brand new RF1 from Era. This is a brand new truck. It comes with a ball pivot. It also comes in a couple different hanger widths, as well as some different base plate options. The RF1, from what I've heard, is a more free ride based truck. I got the 46 by 176 hanger, and I'm really looking forward to free riding on these because I'm more of a free rider. And Parker, what about you? I'm riding as well the 46 degree base plate with a 176 millimeter hanger. And I'm more of a downhill skater, so I'm really interested to see on how these are gonna be cornering and be handling at higher speeds. So Parker, what do you think that new ball pivot's gonna feel like before you ride it? I'm interested to see on how it compares to the K5, because with a ball pivot, it's not gonna force you back into a return to center. <laughs> 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 and it's, it's going to be a bit more of a free range of motion throughout your turn. Interesting. I'm really excited to try it out because it's new. I love new stuff. So <laughs> new and shiny things. Yeah, it's gold. It matches my other gold ones. So I'm looking forward to go uh, to go try these out today. We're going to go out like a couple of ducks and get this bread. Quack, quack. So I've taken these RF1s down a hill a couple times and they feel really cool. In comparison to my K5s, they feel much looser. They like turn a lot more. They feel a lot surfier. They stay leaned over a little bit more, which makes it easier to smush out like smearing slides. For free riding so far, I really like them. I'm very impressed. And they also turn a lot, even on a big board like this. Even though they're a 46 degree, they seem to feel like they turn more than my K5s do that are also a 46 degree, which is pretty cool. Ultimately, the 176 hanger, I can't really notice too much of a difference compared to like other 180 trucks and 174 trucks that I've been riding. It doesn't feel too grippy, but it also feels kind of snappy, which I like. I think that the ball pivots really allowing this hanger to turn a lot more and help steer out of slides and also give me a little bit more in terms of range while sliding, being able to whip the truck around because it releases a little sooner. Mine's longer. Yeah. So I was out skating the RF1s all day. It was super awesome. Uh, really enjoyed the surfiness. In fact, they lean over a little bit more and they stay there. Makes them a lot more fun to stand up slide. And now we're going to get Parker out on the streets to show you what's up with a little bit faster free riding, a little bit more directional drifting. Let's get that bread.
pretty skeptical on how twitchy the ball pivot was actually gonna be, but after doing a couple runs and getting used to the flow of it, I was loving it immediately. Once you get over the fact that it's more of a mental thing, the twitchiness and speed wobbles in general are more mental than physical, it became a really fun, super easy truck to do anything on. I'm gonna be trying them out in a more corner set type of skating. You're coming in hot, but not so bright Making a meal of any appetite Just take it easy Cause if I held you up against the light I could see clear enough to cut right To where you weakest full day on the era rf1 to summarize i think these are great trucks if you're a bit more of a confident downhill skater and want to get that extra edge through your leans these are much more forgiving than the k5s without having that distinct return to center you're able to just really sink into your pivot cups and be able to just lean as far as you want into your slides and into your turns at a price of 190 dollars these are a super affordable forged truck from era but if you wanted to bring your free riding up a level this is a great investment for you to keep it even on the light side of feeling I'm Tristan. I'm Brett. I'm Gabe. We're all skating the RF1s in Issaquah at Slug Wars today. Hell yeah, Brett yeah. is so stoked. <laughs> What do you think about the RF1s? Fantastic. Fan flipping tastic. <laughs> Gabe, what do you think of the RF1s? They're great. They're great? They're good. They're good. They're good. They slide good. Turn good. Scoot good. I like them. Savants. I was a little weary about the old ball pivot with these hands, but they proved to stay stable and I like absolute thrill riding these trucks all day. Definitely my favorite free ride trucks that I've ever tried. And with that being said, this has been Parker Schmidt from Motion Board Shop. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, you can leave them in the message box below or give us an email. If you want to give us a call, you can call us at 206-372-5268.